Hi, this is Afia. Welcome to my channel. I hope everyone is doing good. In this video, I want to do a makeup look with the colors black and purple. Basically, I just want to review a new eyeshadow palette that I got, which is from Wet n Wild. It is this palette right here. It has so many beautiful colors, as purple and browns and golds. And I just want to experiment with this eyeshadow palette. So I will be using this palette in particular today for my eye makeup. I might add in a few other eyeshadows from other palettes as well. I'm not really sure what I want to do. I just have a very vague picture in mind. We'll see what kind of look it ends up being. I will first go to my skincare and get back so that we can start with the makeup. I'm done with the skincare so let's just quickly begin with the makeup. I'm going to begin my makeup by applying some primer. The primer has instantly blurred my pores. I'm just going to use some concealer as an eye base to begin the eye makeup. Applying some powder over the eye base to set it. Now for the eyeshadow, I am thinking of doing a nice smoky eye and going ahead with one of uh, the purple colors in this palette under my lower lash line. Lower lash line is that what it's called? So I'm just going to use one of these colors, these three colors here. Not sure which one yet. Let's just focus on the smoky eye for now. I'm just going to take the darkest brown here and apply it on the inner corner and outer corner of my eye. These eyeshadows are so pigmented. I'm just going to take this brown transition shade here to blend the black. It's blending out really easily. I want to add some black metallic eyeshadow but unfortunately there is none in this palette so I'm just going to grab my other palette to do that. So I have the old palette here, it's broken, it's been ages since I used this palette. I'm just going to take another blending brush and take this grey colour, I don't know how it's going to look. I'm just going to swipe it all over the lid. Okay. I think this is good enough. You can replace the black glitter. You can use the golden in the Wet n Wild palette as well or any other color of your preference. Okay, I feel like this is good enough. I'm just going to quickly finish the other eye as well. I'm just going to quickly finish my base before I go ahead with the purple on my lower lash line. I'm going to start with my base by applying some color corrector on my under eyes and the pigmentation around my mouth as well. I'm then going to go ahead with the concealer. If you have seen my previous video about the Nykaa haul, you know that this HD concealer from inside did not do it for me but I am willing to give it another chance so I'm going to include it in my makeup today to see how it performs. I don't know why it always leaves a dark spot there. I don't like it. I just don't like its finish and it is a bit patchy, so I don't like that. The next step would be the foundation. The foundation that I applied is the Inside True Skin Serum Foundation and it is truly skin-like. I just love the finish of this foundation. I'm now going ahead with contour. Makeup is set. I'm just going to go ahead with the eyebrows. Now I'm going to go ahead and finish my eye makeup. I think I'm going to go ahead with the third shade here for my lower lash line. I'm just going to add a little bit of this purple as well. with this champagne color here for my inner corners I'm just using this mauve blush today because I feel like it will complement the look the next step is highlighter I'm using this 
highlighter. <gasps> Got scared for a second. I'm going to set my face with some setting spray before I go ahead with the eyeliner and mascara to finish the look. I feel like this look is going to look good with a kajal, so I'm going to apply some. one final step and that is the lips i recently bought this inside lip color in the shade warm nude i got it for my nika hot but i did not get to wear it so i'm thinking i'll wear this but i don't know if it's going to match my eye that lip color was bad it was too bright i'm just going ahead with this maybelline lipstick in the shade more Okay, so the lipstick is too warm toned and a little too dark uh, for my makeup look today and I'm just not feeling it but I do want to take it off again and apply another layer of lipstick so I'm just going to use a silver lip gloss over this to tone it down a bit. Always works. I'm done with the makeup I just draped my hijab properly to come and show you how it actually looks so this is the final look I think for a black smoky eye this look has turned out pretty great I love the pop of color under my eye I'm just so proud of myself because I was always scared of using black over my eyes as an eyeshadow now I have used just black all over my eye and it looks good I love how smooth my base looks if you have any recommendations of any video that you would like me to make or if you have any makeup products that you would like me to review before you get it then please do let me know i will definitely review those products for you and i think for me this palette is a win it has so many beautiful colors and the eyeshadows are very pigmented as well i think i got this palette for around 300 something so if you are looking to get a new eyeshadow palette you can definitely check this out thank you so much for watching and i will see you in the next video bye